This afternoon, CBS 11 News got a behind the scenes look of Denton Spire's new state of the art training facility. And it was up close and personal. That simulates a flashover right there. The facility includes a six story building. Inside, sensors stop and restart fires based on the room's temperatures. If you don't get it cooled down enough, okay. the fire will come back up on you. Staircases force firefighters to maneuver through congested spaces. Firefighters led city leaders and me through the scene. Next door, there is a flashover chamber and a space to hold real fires. You think this new training facility saves lives? It absolutely does. The gear weighs 40 to 50 pounds. It took us at least 15 minutes to get it all on. The pros do it in 60 seconds or less. Here's Denton's police chief. It's awesome. Uh, it does reaffirm the fact that uh, I picked the right career field, <laughs> chasing guys with guns and we we're putting this stuff on. It's a two plus million dollar facility that's been in the works for more than a decade, and it's only phase one. The department's public information officer says city leaders are now considering adding rubble rescue and building collapse scenes. Today, the mayor likes what he saw. It was quite an experience. I really think that uh, every policymaker should be able to have this experience. Fire Chief Kenneth Hedges. We're just very appreciative of our council members, our citizens funding this facility for us. We haven't had anything like this in the history of the fire department. The facility is expected to serve more than 500 firefighters across at least 25 departments. It was fun stuff out there today.